Carlos Masters, District Governor, Distinguished Guest. Today we'll be evaluating Michi, she's doing it back there, on her speech, Shapers and Shifters. The first thing I felt about her speech was that it's a topic that's definitely very close to her heart. It's a topic which, which tells us how, how she came, what, what's her principle in life, for example, how did she end up being so strong and so uh, capable and uh, dependent, uh, independent woman. So her topic uh, tells us about her family, where she's gotten her strength from primarily, from her grand grandmother, from her mother, and the two daughters. I realize that you focus a lot on your, your grandmother, because I understand that she must have given you a lot of uh, inspiration, give you a lot of strength, someone that you really admire too. So, Thanks for sharing that with us. We really appreciate that. It's hard to find fault with your speech because I feel, from my perspective, that it's such a it's a wonderfully craft speech, and I feel that it's a very it's a very it's a speech that that's very tells a lot about your perception in life, and that's a wonderful icebreaker because you want to tell your audience what's your philosophy and life and how do you view life and how do you see, see life from, from, from your point of view. So I think that's something that's very good and very, very generous of you to share with the rest of the audience and we really appreciate that. So in terms of improvement, I think one of the things that you could improve on is your title. Shapers and shifters, it's hard to put an, an idea into it, shapers and shifters, because the term shap shapers and shifters is used primarily for industry movers. It was used primarily for people who, who have a huge impact uh, into the society or corporate or the world as a general. But I'm sure why you use shapers and shifters is because it has such a profound impact on you that you feel that they are your shapers and shifters. But maybe in the future you could want to use a, a better title that that resonates well with the audience. So, what I feel that you did really well was in the structure. I, I enjoyed the structure of your speech. It is very clear, it's very concise. So you have four points and you elaborate the, each one of them very clearly. And we follow, you, you actually brought the audience to each point and we follow closely and we, we enjoy immensely your speech. And that's a lovely speech that you have. So that's something that you could, that you had. So keep on doing that and looking forward to hearing your second thing.